Good morning children, glad to meet you again today. Before we start our activities, let us start the day with a meditation with God's word this morning, taken from Journey to God's Promised Land book, written by Pastor Maralab Sagala. Our topic for today is God punished Miriam in Hazareth. Before we proceed, shall we start with a prayer? Thank you Lord for the new day. Now we are ready to listen to your words. May your Holy Spirit be within us. Thank you Lord. Amen. Our memory verse for today is from Numbers chapter 12 verse 10. It says, When the cloud lifted from above the tent, Miriam's skin was leprous. It became as white as snow. Aaron turned toward her and saw that she had a defiling skin disease. Miriam is the older sister of Moses. Aaron and Miriam is always accompanying Moses on the journey of Israel since leaving Egypt up to the promised land of God. Miriam loved her younger brother Moses very much. When Moses was born and still a baby, she was the one who took care of Moses when his mother tried to save Moses from death. However, when Israel traveled after leaving Kibrat Hadava, where God punished the Israelites for being greedy for meat, and arrived at Hazareth, God punished Miriam. Jealousy grew in the hearts of Miriam and Aaron as well. Miriam and Aaron began to talk against Moses because of his Cushite wife, for he had married a Cushite. Miriam and Aaron questioned the duties and the position of Moses. Has the Lord spoken only through Moses? They asked. Hasn't he also spoken through us? And the Lord heard this. God displeased the attitude of Miriam and Aaron. That's when God punished Miriam with leprosy. When Aaron saw Miriam that her skin was leprosy, he begged Moses to forgive them. Now Moses was a very humble man, more humble than anyone else on the face of the earth. So Moses cried out to the Lord, Please, God, heal her. The great heart and humbleness of Moses, who forgave his brother and sister, so that by the grace of God, Miriam was healed. So children, let us be humble just like Moses, who likes to forgive especially to our brothers and sisters just as Jesus also likes to forgive our sins. This is the end of our morning worship. May God bless us today. Amen.